so cozy guys we were holding hands while walking out of Monty oh how dare you like how dare you <laughs> hey guys hey guys hey guys hey guys what it is what's good hey what's happening what it hey what it is what's good hey what's happening what it is hey what it is what's good hey, what's happening what it do let's get right into this makeup oh see how dare you like how dare you anyway guys welcome to my channel if you are new welcome 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 thank you so much for joining the family you are more than welcome don't forget to like this video comment down below on what you think about this makeup honey because i'm about to do a tutorial on this okay and not only is it a tutorial i'll be unboxing and reviewing hermosa flow cosmetics eyeshadow palette daisy daisy eyeshadow palette okay i know that's right okay period guys so if you like this look tell me right now if you like it don't forget to like comment subscribe and share this video share it with your friends okay yes guys so let's get right into this video so guys i'm going to okay i've already done my face offline meaning i've done my foundation concealer highlight and a bit of contouring so right now i'm gonna do my eyeshadow i'm gonna be using this daisy palette by hermosa floor cosmetics now guys you know what i think this is a dream come true for me look at that it's so beautiful guys it's literally so beautiful look at that this is the girl that she thinks she is honestly so i bought it i pre-ordered it on the homosa floor cosmetics website so i know like a lot of you obviously know homosa floor cosmetics because it's very popular now so i decided to buy my own eyeshadow palette and actually do a review so i hope that um i'm gonna love it i don't know for sure what i'm gonna start like which colors i'm gonna do but i'm just gonna start off by prepping my face and i've decided to use a different concealer which is more like brighter and lighter it's on my all woman eyeshadow palette so i'm just gonna i don't know like if this is a concealer or i don't know but i'm just gonna use it as like a prep or primer for my eyeshadow so i'm just gonna start off in the middle i didn't wanna is it light enough though I don't want to use my LA Girl Cosmetics concealer because I felt like it's too, like it's not going to pop my eyeshadow the way. But you know what guys, I've noticed that a lot of people who've actually used Hermosa Flow have actually like, you know what, the, eyesh the eyeshadow is actually very pigmented. So already I expect it to be very pigmented. I'm not going to put a lot, put a lot of concealer so yeah guys um if you guys don't know who mbali sebapo is she uh aka gorgeous mbali please check her out on instagram she's selling all these products you guys obviously know her but for some people who don't know like who she is she is a boss she's a boss guys you definitely need to support black excellence black businesses i really love what she's done with her business she's grown so much and if, for those of you guys who don't know how she started she was in the not the military the navy so the the navy is like 
the sea version of the military so she actually i think she worked 10 years in that industry and then she resigned or quit her job and started her her cosmetic business and she is thriving literally she's thriving so like i said i'm not gonna put too much concealer i'm just going to powder that area so that everything is set i'm gonna use my yardly translucent powder yo it's upside down um i was already using it to powder my to powder my what's this hey i can't find my brush to powder my to highlight my face basically to set my highlighter so I'm just gonna put a bit of that here. I'm not gonna overdo it. See? I'm not gonna overdo it. Okay guys, so now I'm gonna go right ahead and actually start with my new palette i'm so so excited and while i'm doing my makeup i'm gonna guys i'm gonna tell you guys about my top three dates it was i was so excited so i don't know i think in let me say the latest okay i don't know um there's no brown so i'm just gonna see how this brown looks it's called true love i'm gonna see how it looks i'm just gonna try to pack it on my crease and see how it actually looks as like in a way a transitioning brown so do you guys see how pigmented that is i put a little bit so yeah guys as i was saying uh my date like a very great date experience that i had um in no particular order but i think let me say according to the latest date that i was on so i went out with this other guy i met him and he asked me out for a date and then uh so basically this guy isn't even like he's not south african he is from the usa he stays in chicago illinois anyway <laughs> i feel like if there was like a love of my life that i actually fumbled it's him so this guy he like he was so calm do you know what calm is i don't have proper brushes i'm gonna buy mbali's brushes like mbali can have my coins i'm already impressed look at this brown guys so yeah this guy is from chicago illinois and yeah when we met we the first time we were at his place like the first date we were at his place and he decided well his place in Joburg he was visiting his friend so he was at the friend's place so yeah he decided to cook for me and he actually taught me how to cook he's a chef so he cooked what did so I was this thing wasn't recording and I was already telling you guys two stories so after the brown i went in with new i just did like i took a bit well quite a lot and then i just went in to the bridge of my eye like so so guys <clears throat> i was just telling you about my top three best dates so this guy isn't from sa we met in Joburg. And then he asked me out for a date 
and what he did was he was actually staying over at his friend's place so okay i'm gonna go in with harmony she's black um so he's a chef and he cooked for me i'm just gonna put a bit like so so this guy he decided to cook for me yo guys this eyeshadow is so pigmented yo like look at this black i put so like i put a bit hey and now it's black black like it's black black anywho it's fine we'll see what happens anywho this guy decided to cook for me he cooked oxtail and uh, rice with beans and some vegetables so like he was in the process he was actually teaching me how to cook that oxtail chef style busy using my wine like it is so nice guys it is so nice then on the second date we went to rockets this black is so pigment like this whole look is changed now yeah so this now looks like a smoky eye look at that like literally the, the whole look has changed so yeah we went to rockets it was just like we were not partying or anything like that we were just chilling he was so nice he was a gentleman he was so nice like that's one of the most nicest people i've ever met in my life even still today we still talk like literally we still talk and he's planning to come in october i think it's summer for them now anyway so he's not gonna come anytime soon anyway the second date was we i met this other guy he also asked me out for a date and we went to sentence guy well why am i saying sentence guy he stays in sentence guy oh, this whole look has changed guys like what is this okay let me go back in with new just to tone down the black a bit so when we got there i was number one i want to say i was so insecure with this date because like this guy was well traveled like and i must say like with regards to people that i've dated i've dated a lot of people that are like well traveled like it's that thing of wow what have i been doing with my life so this guy was busy telling me where he's been to like on the date it was nice we were just vibing he was telling me where he's been to and yeah he said he's been to why do i keep forgetting this place and it's like i really want to go to this place it's called it's not pp islands it's maldives i really want to go to maldives he's been to maldives he showed me the pictures he's been to he's been to he's literally been everywhere he's been to bora bora he's been to i feel like now i'm gonna put too much okay let me just blend everything out he's been to maldives he's been to bora bora he's been to um he's been to america miami he's been to paris he's been everywhere literally okay i feel like i put so much makeup i put like the black child the black but look at how pigmented this eyeshadow is you guys like this is the excess so yeah and then um i was so insecure like in the date i was so insecure he bought 
you know Cutfather is a seafood restaurant anyway. So from when we when I got there, we I went to Sentence Guy and I waited in the lobby because that's where he stayed. And he said he's just getting his jacket. Then we went to Cutfather. It's like it's the same thing. It's the same place, but um, it's like a drive away, like five minutes away. Not even five minutes. It's very close, like seconds away. And then he ordered sushi. So the reason I was so insecure is because this guy is well traveled. So now he's he ordered sushi. Now it's like I'm panicking. I'm thinking, am I gonna have to eat this sushi? Am I gonna actually have to use chopsticks to eat the sushi? Like, I don't even know the chopstick etiquette. Like, what is gonna happen? So I didn't even touch the sushi. And guys, one thing about me is I love sushi. One thing about me is I love seafood. I love prawns. I love yo. I love um, crab legs. I love I love seafood, guys. So it's also one of the reasons why I feel like I wish. Oh, I'm going back in with true love because now the colors are not showing. It's one of the reasons where I wish, like, we actually had desk, Dash Kitchen SA here in my figuring. Anyway, yeah, so we, he, we had, well, he had the sushi and I ordered a risotto. He ordered ribs and something, I don't know. And he was digging into that food. Then later on, we went in back to his place with, for a nightcap, and I like soon left. I was so uncomfortable, you guys. I was not uncomfortable, but I was like, shit, like, you know, that imposter syndrome. I don't even know, like, how you get imposter syndrome with a person. Like, I had that. Because the, the date was so lovely. Everything was so lovely. Everything about him, like... He was... That man was, number one, attractive. Number two, well-traveled. Number three, a businessman. Number four, he was so handsome, guys. I won't even lie. But something about him just made me so insecure. Like... I've, and I never feel like that with guys. He just made me so insecure. So I'm going to use the... The con the concealer I was using to actually prep my eye. And I'm just going to cut my crease. Uh, let me check what the best date, the other best... <gasps> Ooh, and the other best date, it was also recent. Oh my gosh, this guy's also well traveled. Like, ish. And these guys are so attractive, guys. So, this one, um, uh, it was in four ways. So firstly, we went to a restaurant and we had seafood, of course. Well, I ordered seafood. He also ordered seafood, but he, he ordered a risotto and, oh my gosh, look at that. He ordered a risotto and I ordered, what did I order? Prawns and um, I think I have a picture. I'll actually show it to you guys. I ordered prawns and something else. Guys, this is how pigmented this uh, eyeshadow is. Like, every time I try to pick on the concealer, the eyeshadow comes through. Through the concealer. Imagine. Okay, I'm gonna stop there. So he ordered a risotto. I ordered prawns and... I think it was like prawns and a salad. Uh, yeah, so, um, and then after that, we went to go, like, get ready for going out. I didn't really get ready. Like, my shoe had broke. All I needed was to change my shoe, my heel. 
so we went to go change and then initially we were supposed to meet up with his friends but his friends didn't pull through so we went to monte casino in four ways and yeah we basically went to like a bar number one i don't know what the name of the restaurant that we went to was but it was like a five minute drive away from his place it wasn't very far from his place and then so from the by the way like on our way to to the date like he opened the door for me the car door for me he pulled my chair for me like he was such a gentleman he he was legit a gentleman and when we got to the bar place yo guys this this eyeshadow is super pigmented so it's giving me an idea of what i want to do with this crease the cut crease so anyway okay i'm done cutting my crease so anyway let me just wait for it to dry up yeah at the restaurant um, he pulled in my he pulled out my chair for me he was busy asking me like are you okay do you want anything else at uh the bar we legit were enjoying each other's company there was even like couples dancing on the dance floor we also danced and then like at the end of the date at the end of the night we were so cozy like we were so cozy guys we were holding hands while walking out of monte casino yo it was so nice he was such a gentleman i won't lie what else yeah, he was just a gentleman. I really commend him for that. And then the other date that I was on. Oh, that is the last, the final date that I was on. But anyway, you guys, I feel like this guy's also well traveled, by the way. He used to stay in Atlanta at some point. Um, I think it was in maybe two years back. So he was just telling me like how it is that side and how the lady how the ladies are so over here I'm actually going back in with the true love. Yeah, just telling me how the ladies were etc 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 how the place is how there's something for everyone like literally if you want to be an influencer like you can do that if you want to like everything there's just options if you want to be into retail you can do that if you want to be uh working in a restaurant you can end up as a manager if you want to work at a clothing store you can end up as a manager stuff like that yeah so i don't even know what to do with these eyes i'm gonna go in with let me see i think i must just go back in with scarlet Ooh, scarlet is already pigmented i can see that so i'm just gonna put a bit of scarlet here Musa floor really is the girl she thinks she is. This palette is amazing, guys. Okay, let me try to stop talking a lot and just wrap this look up. Oh, I poked my eye.
okay and in the insides inside corners of my eye I'm just gonna go in with Dawn this is Dawn please Dawn please do what you have to do Dawn really is the girl she thinks she is. Okay guys, I'm just going to wrap up this look without speaking. The, the video is actually part of my previous video which is the updated foundation highlight and contour routine so please watch it
shake it, baby. Hey, hey, hey.